It's not working out for me. Wait, sorry, what was that? I bought a Corolla. Did you? No. Oh. You did. did. Jess, did did you buy a Corolla? I would never do that. Oh. Well, who bought this Corolla? You. This guy. <laughs> And it's the cleanest thing in history. <laughs> like, actually, it's the cleanest one I've ever seen. What are we doing, Dil? Um, I just bought a new car. Yeah? Yeah. Do you want to show us? Yeah, yeah, it's because... Can I let me? Just pass by this piece of shit right here. Um... Bye bye, Crescita. This is my new 1983 Toyota Corolla XX model. Exact same as Matt's. Yeah. In white. Bodies. And it is super clean. Like, amazingly. Check for rust. None. Just chilling. With my new bag. Interior shots. Interior is amazing. Oh, yeah. It's like the cleanest thing in history. I'm quite jealous, if I'm honest. And yeah, it's pretty cool blue. Dylan stole my blue shifter because I stole his greeny blue one that's bigger. We swapped bigger dildos. <laughs> um, but yeah, like, it's literally just bone stock. And it actually came with a roadie and, like, just shit you don't hear of. It's got CSX alloys. Like, it's granny spec as. It's amazing. I'm, so, I'm really jealous. I'm really happy for him there. Right? Yeah, so I saw an add on Gumtree and it was like a uh, four speed manual K70 and it looked really mint uh, for 2500 with a roadworthy. Like, paint wasn't so great um, and had a few dings, and I was like, whatever, that sounds good anyway, you know. Yeah. is a K70. And so I went there and I was like, and it was really, really mean. Like, it was really good uh, and mechanically just like top notch. But he also had this one for sale, and we were, me and Bowden were there, we were just like, what about that one? <laughs> And he's like, yeah, it doesn't run as well, but it's still a freaking good car. And same price, roadworthy, 2500 bucks, like with Reg. And so we were like, fuck yeah. <laughs> so, Give me it. Yeah, we picked it up. So we're taking the old Potenzas off that he had on the original Corolla that no one got to see because we hadn't done the channel yet. Yeah. But now they're going to be on this. And we're going to lower it tomorrow too. So. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Also, yeah. I'm wearing my Corolla. Oh. Yeah, boy. And now he's got that logo on his steering wheel, and it's really cute and romantic and shit. <laughs> <laughs> Dylan cut himself like a retard. And I'm dripping blood on the ground. <laughs> oh, savage. I didn't actually cut it, I just punched the ground with my hand. Yeah, because you're tough. Yeah, I'm a tough Dylan guy. got really mad at the ground and Brrr, belted it. Fuck the ground. I'm pissed off at him. You're a loser. Lel. These rooms are so nice. I like them. They're nice. But, oh, the story behind these, right? Dylan bought these off a guy, right? And they were super sweet. And he was like, yeah, they're three-piece, so I can totally just like rebell them and stuff. And the guy's like, yeah, they are three-piece. That's totally cool. So rebelling's really easy for three-piece because you just take the center out. <laughs> and uh, we checked the inside lip and they've just been welded on to the barrel. Yeah, we're from factory, but like... Oh, really? Yeah. I thought someone just did it. No, 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 no. So you just ruined my like a budget wheel. Um, oh. Yeah. So you just thought they were three, so they're just made to look like it. Yeah. I don't, I actually, in hindsight, I think I just thought they were three-piece. I'm pretty sure he said in the ad even that they were welded, and I was just like, whatever, that means they're three-piece. Because <laughs> I was a little young gimp. But I, I'll still be able to, I reckon, um, take it to a machining shop and get them to, um, or whatever. Get them to cut it evenly, yeah. Cut it, and then yeah, yeah. put the face on a different I think, barrel, actually, set of barrels. Well, if anyone's watching, tell us if you've ever done that. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, well, people have rebelled like steelies and shit, yeah. so of course. Because when my car got but, stolen... But where did you go, lol? What? I'm just asking. Who went Who went where to rebel things that went three-piece in oh, Melbourne? Right. Oh, okay. My first Corolla <laughs> got stolen once. Yeah. And um, so they like absolutely mounted the shit out of curb. And so the front left is just completely ground. Like, yeah. So I really want to rebarrel them. Hopefully. It costs a lot of money, but... They don't look fantastic. Just thought I'd briefly talk about my boot from my casita that I had here. <laughs> Just one day I fucking went to go get a fresh boot lid because this one is rusted as hell. Right down in there is freaking rusted. And same within there. And I couldn't fit it in the car because it's like the size of a car. 
So my mate Josh just got his battery angle grinder and we chopped it in half on the side of the street. And I had it in my boot for like a month. <laughs> we only just boot. pulled it out today. Speaking of boots, this is a new K70s boot with carpet. What do you mean? Ooh. Squad. Where? So we're taking some photos yeah. of the new rig. Looks like criminals. Oofed. Looks pretty cool. Dude, I'm gonna rub out. I'm gonna cover it white marker above the bottom bit of your piece. So your number plate says oofed. Oofed. <laughs> so we're testing bolts because I'm putting plastic bumpers on my car. Original OG shit. Hey. Matt's anti-JVM fanboy. Yeah, legit. And T18 bars are quite expensive. So if anyone's watching and they want them, hit me up, fam. Give me some cash. Yeah. Five buck. Plus a few hundred. And then maybe I'll be swapping to a super OG flat front. Maybe. I'm not sure yet. I probably will. I'll see. I'm kind of sick of the whole chrome cord light thing. Yeah. Maybe it was a phase. I like, see, Dylan's is OG as shit. How good does it look in the daylight, dude? Looks pretty good. And what are we going to do? Sounds better because those wheels have shitty paint on them. On this side. Okay. What are we going to do? Um, we're going to lower it today, aren't we, dude? Oh, yeah. We're going to put some. Fucking oath, man. Some shorter springs in the back and probably. Um, modify the ones in the front. Mo modify, ex elaborate, Dylan. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. What? <laughs> Not in a K70 strut, anyway. Yeah. Um, we're waiting for a guy to come look at this car, so hopefully we can sell it and I can give money to my loan sharks. And, um, cool Matt, do a 180. No. 180 for the old times. Right. Come on, no, for, for, the, for the memories. On do a 180 for that time you earned a 180. It all comes down to this. Shut up, Matt. The internet has to know whether you can 180. Oh, you suck! Or die. That was way closer. Yeah. What are you doing, Matt? You you becoming JDM. a JDM fanboy again? No, I'm actually deleting this. Oh. Delete this. What? I'm shaving it. Because you're a muscle car guy. Or you own a VW. I used to. <laughs> I used to be a Eurofag. It's over there. No, I didn't. Mum bought me it to learn it. And I was like, no. Such a Eurofag. I'd rather have a real You're like, I want fucking 1552 Tarmax with, with no offset. No. And to bag it. So record, 1552 wheels are not cool. Oh, that's a bit rude. I actually think they're quite cool. No, if not. you buy the right ones. Yeah, I was going to say. But the ones that everyone buys aren't cool. You're so prejudiced. We just sold the orange car. Some dude just came up and was like, yeah, alright, I'll take it. It's the chillest thing ever. Yeah, it was so cool. I don't know if he's watching this. But... So, he might. He said he'd watch some of that stuff. Um, but yeah, so we're in Dylan's brand new car. And we're on that's the way amazing. to Bunnings to get some Boltorinos for my plastic, plastic bars. Plastic bars, so it can be OG. Yeah, so now... This is really where the journey begins, like, you guys only knew who we were when there was one Corolla and, like, the main thing that brought me and Dylan together was basically his yellow car. Yeah, my old yellow K70. So, Which like, I sold the day before we made the channel. Yeah, li like, literally. Yeah. So, this is like a better, a much better depiction of the, of the group, I reckon. Yes. This is going to be way cooler, so. Also, this is definitely I'm be... so stoked on this car. Yeah, Because it's amazing. actually got potential and it's got a rope with these and everything. I don't have to fucking piss around with that shit. Yeah, watch it. So, it is the beginning of an era. Yeah, well, there's going to be heaps of cool shit, so keep watching, please. Yeah, let's say stay tuned like everybody stay does and then never update. Yeah, all right. Okay. Yeah, all right. Well, cool. actually, also, now that my garage is empty, I'm going to do a brakey in it, so... Yeah, and I'm going to show my face and my plates and everything because it's my own fucking property, so it's going to be sick. <laughs> <laughs> Yo.
Ja. Matt's boot is rusty. Mm. It's not very nice. It's pretty shit, dude. At least your car is holy. Saint-like, even. Yeah. I'm gonna be a vlogger and do this whole thing. My name's D D B Hunt. D B Hunt. I'm six foot. Ha ha. Actually. <laughs> no, he's always talking about that shit. Same with Adam Alzheimer. Like, yeah. I'm six foot one, so I ride a big bike. Have you guys do you know I'm six foot one and I ride a big bike? Anyway, let's stop bagging other people on YouTube because they're actually nice guys. Yeah. We got sweet bars on Matt's car. I reckon it looks awesome. I agree with it. Like the OG look. Yeah. The T18 bars are cool, I guess. But they don't match as well, I don't reckon. No, no way. Especially from the back now. That looks so OG. Oh. And it fits this little thing here instead of going the wrong way. <laughs> I reckon it looks way more mean. Matt just has to get rid of this stupid roller badge. He's a pleb. I'm taking out the springs from this car because these are nice springs, nice height. And I'm going to put them in my car and then we're going to... Um, yeah, the front. Fuck you, S13 wheel. Do you graffiti, Matt? Yeah. Sick. <laughs> Thanks, man. Are you proud of me? No, you're not my son. Shit! <laughs> what? So I just realized this is your problem. This is a tie? Yeah. Why? Because there's just no way to loop it around the work for one another, but. <laughs> <laughs> it was like the corner bolts we don't have. Oh, See how yeah. the front bumpers are like on the corners like that? Yeah. Dude your car looks so shiny. Yeah. I know. You should see it on the camera, goddamn. Because it is. Yeah, we gotta get those corner bolts and then it'll be a swell. Looks so much better I reckon. Yeah, me too. I love it. it looks a bit longer. It just looks more K70. Yeah. Dude, I'm stoked on actually filming us doing the work instead of just talking about what we've done. And like updating, you know? The reveal! Dude, the bolt's okay. Yeah. Fuck. Oh my god, dude. Dude, that's gonna be sweet. That's a perfect pack. Yeah. What's your, your sitch? Your indicator doesn't work. And the bulb's okay. Oh no. Tell us what you think of the um flat front. I love them. The plastic bars with the quads. I think it's awesome. Dude. With we were thinking about putting it on um just regular flat front, the square lights like mine. But we're kind of liking the quads now with the black bars. Yeah. I think it looks sweet. I do too. Anywho. I like it. Maybe even just a black flat front. Black flat front would be cool. I reckon they look good on red, like Mark Huxley's one from the UK. You ever seen that one? No. Had an SR in it. So Basically so like the UK Grant Scott. Yay, indicators work. Life is legal now. <laughs> Dude, I got a couple of likes on my comment that said my dog was driving. <laughs> yeah, your Snoop dog was driving. 
<laughs> My dog. Modifying is the technical term. Chopping is the fucking retard term. I hate tyrants. And we're retards, so we're gonna say chopping. <laughs> and all the haters. We're not chopping them that much, okay? It's not that low, like, it's still pretty high. So they actually, like, I run these for ages, Dylan ran these for ages on his old car, mm -hmm. and they're not bouncy. That it ha they never came unseated, like, they never... Yeah, except I chopped the wrong end off, my ones. And they still didn't come unseated, yeah. though, so, like, that... Over the... Oh, yeah. Top hat. That was not good. That was once, though. Maybe we're idiots. we're idiots. Yeah. Congratulations, guys. You've watched long enough to figure out who we are. <laughs> <laughs> High five. <laughs> hey. Hey, man. We modified some springs. Hold on. Here's some modifications we did earlier. <laughs> Here's something we prepared earlier. I didn't use that. That's a tool you don't use to modify springs. That's how it works, right? Jesus died for your tins. Yeah. The fellas died for your choppies. <laughs> but basically what we're saying is that if you think you're a retard and don't know anything about cars, you can just do what we did and just give it a shot. Because like we haven't actually broken anything, you know? Like we haven't, we haven't yeah, fucked well, up. One time we broke my brakes because we tried to put a welded diff into my leather case only. And then we got really depressed and we drove home. All we did was accidentally, like someone accidentally punctured a little... The brake uh, piston like seal so it was just pissing brake fluid everywhere it was a little it literally just pinched it and put the tiniest hole in it but it just made it lose all brake pressure so that's i was gonna say that's the worst as in it's not bad but dawn's car sat on my street <laughs> sat at the bottom of my street for like a month oh it did too didn't it yeah that sucked <laughs> it was hilarious but yeah so if you want to work on cars just do it yeah just do it insert pick of shia labeouf here <laughs> Alrighty. We're going for a drive. Yeah, we're going for a drive. My key is lowered. Matt's got the black bars on it. Yeah, Looks just, sweet. Just for reference, we've been waiting months to do this. So <laughs> Our first go. time driving with the keys. Up top. Yeah, boy.